So even though this one was originally released back in the 90s, in my opinion it really looks still quite futuristic. Hello guys and welcome back for a brand new review, if you are new to the channel please make sure you're gonna subscribe, you can also give me a follow on Instagram to see exactly what I'm gonna review in the next few days. In today's video guys we're gonna have a look at this uh, basketball shoe, so let's go ahead and take them out of the box, which as you can see will come in your normal box, which will be in this uh, red color with the Nike swoosh and the lettering in this white color, so let's go ahead and take them out. So in today's video guys we're gonna have a look at this uh, uh, classic Nike Air Zoom Flight 95. So this uh, basketball shoe guys which was uh, initially released back in the 90s was uh, re-released uh, now uh, here in uh, 2022 at the start of May for a retail price of 145 pounds and as you can see guys even though this one is uh, 20 something years old uh, it still has a very futuristic uh, design with a very chunky uh, midsole and some uh, uh, carbon fiber uh, look-alike uh, materials which to be honest I kind of like it and I was actually afraid that this one will actually be a very heavy shoe which apparently it's not so uh, let's go ahead and also do a breakdown of this one guys so as you can see for most of the upper we're gonna have mainly this uh, no box uh, material which will actually be a synthetic one so this one will be in this uh, black color which as you can see will also have some wavy pattern on it but uh, covering here uh, the front part of the Tobo section we're also gonna have this uh, synthetic uh, white leather and uh, just uh, above it on the actual uh, top part of the Tobo section we're also gonna have this uh, very big Nike swoosh uh, in this uh, black and white color stitched and as we go uh, to the actual lacing system guys uh, we're gonna have your normal uh, punch out holes which will make room for this uh, round uh, black laces which uh, will also have this uh, white uh, hints on it and just underneath these laces guys we're gonna have this uh, black tongue which will be made out of some uh, mesh and we'll also have some knobbock on top of it so this one will actually have a good amount of padding but now as you get to the midfoot guys uh, we're gonna have this uh, rubberized material which uh, tries to replicate the carbon fiber but uh, the actual pattern is gonna be actually quite nice and uh, this one uh, it will go from the midfoot all the way to the back and it will actually cover the whole uh, heel section and also here uh, on the lateral side of the ankle section we're also gonna have this very big Nike swoosh in this white color but as you go inside of the shoe guys you can see that we're gonna have a black lining which underneath will actually have a decent amount of padding and also at the bottom guys we're also gonna have this black foam insole which will also have the Nike Air written and also Nike swoosh in this white color here at the heel section but now as we get to the back of the shoe guys you can see that we're also gonna have a very interesting pull tab in this black color which will also have a written flight in this white color so this one in my opinion really uh, finishes up uh, quite uh, interesting this uh, back part of the shoe and now guys uh, we can go to this uh, EVA uh, foam uh, midsole which as you can see uh, here at the back uh, it's uh, trying to give us also a slight support uh, for the lateral sides and this one will also have uh, incorporated this uh, bug eyes I would say which uh, on the lateral side will also have written air so this one uh, it's also having the same pattern as the rest of the top part of the shoe with this uh, carbon fiber uh, design and I need to admit guys that this one uh, as you can see it's actually uh, quite a wide uh, uh, 
a midsole which uh, most definitely it will give you a good support and as I said at the start of the video this one uh, being an EVA midsole is not gonna add too much weight to the overall shoe and this uh, shoe guys uh, will uh, have an air zoom unit uh, uh, here at the front of the shoe and uh, here at the back we're gonna have an air sole unit so uh, apparently this one is one of the first uh, shoes which uh, has used this uh, airzone uh, technology not a lot of people know about it but apparently this one uh, was uh, one of the very first few and now guys uh, we can finish with this uh, white rubber outsole which as you can see has a wavy pattern and uh, here uh, just between the heel and the forefront we're also gonna have this uh, carbon fiber uh, material again which will also be covered by this uh, very hard uh, plastic shell and this one will also be uh, present here on the sides so this one most definitely it will give you a support and also a stability as in for the actual sizing guys for this one i decided to go with my true to size and for me as i have a skinny fit this one fits me just fine and i guess it will be roughly the same for people with normal feet but just in case you have a wider fit i would suggest you to go either with your true to size or even try a half size up and that will be mainly because this front part of the shoe is not going to be too wide so most definitely that will be a problem for you so overall guys this return of this uh, zoom uh, flight 95 uh, it's actually a very interesting one and even though uh, this design is uh, 20 something years old uh, for me at least uh, it really still feels uh, a bit futuristic and uh, giving that uh, we're gonna have I would say uh, more than decent materials on this one uh, I guess the price is a bit justified and I need to admit that I was actually uh, quite pleasant surprised uh, by the actual uh, weight of this one I really felt that uh, it's gonna be actually a heavy shoe but giving that uh, we have this EVA midsole uh, this one is not gonna be as heavy as I uh, initially thought but uh, unfortunately for me as I have a skinny feet uh, this one really feels like a very large boot but if you can just pass uh, this uh, small inconvenient I guess this one it's overall a good uh, basketball shoe which uh, once again it brings uh, quite decent materials so uh, yeah guys this was my unboxing and reviewing of this uh, return of a classic for the nike air zoom flight 95 i really hope uh, you've enjoyed this video and if you did uh, don't forget to press the like button maybe also subscribe to the channel you can also give me a follow on instagram to see exactly what i'm gonna review in the next few days and as always i will see you in my next one thanks for watching